Alright, I am back. Um, just got off of work. Finally got time to play. Um, yeah. Otherwise, I'm gonna go ahead and mute myself. He's got a whole lot of customers, or he doesn't have any. Right. Not very appetizing. Frozen solid. Who'd want to eat this? Bet that's what Beast was talking about. Hmm. That logo looks familiar. I've seen this before, at the Tweedles. Bigby Wolf? What happened to you? I'm looking for a piece of the magic mirror. Um, wh what? The magic mirror's missing shard. Where is it? Bloody Mary brought it here, didn't she? What? B Bloody Mary? Magic mirror shard? <laughs> what kind of place do you think this is? Don't bullshit me. I'm not. What you're looking for, I... I think you'd be better off looking at uh, the Lucky Pond. Yeah, or someplace like that. You know where it is, right? It's around the corner and a few blocks down. I've been there. I didn't find what I was looking for. Had some words with Jersey, too. Words? Anyway, if, if I'd have known you already looked at the Lucky Pawn, I, I, I wouldn't have pointed you there. I, I just figured anything worth a damn in Fable Town goes through Jersey's hands at some point. You know that. Believe me, I don't want to waste your time, Sheriff. And I certainly don't mean to offend. Yeah, well, Jersey wasn't very helpful. In fact, he was a total asshole. Oh, sorry. I've only been in that place a couple of times. I, I guess I don't know him too well. Listen, Crane had the mirror. Mary had Crane. And she comes around here, right? If you're covering for her, I'm gonna have a problem with you. So you better think real hard about what you say next. I... Sheriff, I... Did you hear that? What? Oh, I'm real sorry. Hold on. I, I just gotta go check on that. No, don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. Butcher? I just have to go see. What's the problem? I'm just coming back to give you a hand. I'm sorry, Sheriff, but you're not supposed to be back here for uh, safety purposes. Come on, damn it. You're such an innocent guy, you're acting pretty damn strange, Johan. I don't know what to tell you. Oh, 
Oh, you gotta be kidding me. They're gonna kill me. Oh, God, she is gonna fucking kill me. He's gonna get me killed. Huh? How you doing? Please, please, Bigby. Please don't. Bigby? What happened to Sheriff? Please don't kill me, Sheriff. I don't want to die. Please, please don't kill me. If you don't talk, I might have to do just that. Is that what you want, Johan? No, no, please. You don't have to do that. I'm dead. Either way, they said to me, Johan, you could keep your life and lose your shop or lose both. What would you do? It, it was a simple choice to make in the moment. Easy, even when they got you on a hook in the deep freeze. Just open the door, Johan. And it won't be your problem anymore. I, I can't. Why not? What's back there? I don't know. I, honest. I, I've never been back there. It's locked from the other side. Look, I, I just worked the front. That's all I'm supposed to do. Well, who locked the fucking door? I, I'm not part of their crew. I, I don't know who or, or what goes on back there. Crew? The Crooked Man's people. Jersey Devil, D and Dumb, and that mental case Bloody Mary. Y you want to talk about the real butcher? <laughs> it's her, not me. This is her place. I'm telling you, they muscled in on me. Took over my storage and delivery a long time ago. All cause of that heat wave. That summer was even hotter than this one. Oh, I'd let Mary and those porkers stay cool in the meat locker one day, playing cards, having a great time. I guess they were sizing the place up. Shows what I get for being nice. I'm just a victim in this. I don't know what they do back there. I swear. A and I don't want to know. It's all right. I believe you. Calm down. I knew this would happen. Didn't know when. Shh. Is this place? I told you, Big P. I don't know. They muscled me out. I swear, I don't know anything more. I haven't been back here when it was like this. Warning lights. This business. It's all I've ever had. These lights, Johan. Did you warn them I was here? I had to. You come in here making trouble for me. But you only give a shit now because the crooked man stepped on your toes or something. Where were you when they took this place from me? It hasn't been easy for me. You, you think I want to live with this at my back? I needed help. Well, I'm here now. I'm gonna sort this all out. So this is what Beast was delivering. Glamours, other kinds of magic. Could be dangerous stuff. That symbol, it's on all the packages. What is it? That's the Crooked Man's uh, brand. It's on everything that goes in and out of here. So you do know something, huh? Is that a, a wheel or what? Guess they never used that thing on wolves, huh? What's that supposed to mean? It's from back in the homelands. A torture device. It came over here with the rest of our stories. Not that Mondays need any help coming up with that kind of thing. It makes people crooked. Like breaking their bones and... Do I really need to explain this? bad they had time to erase it all. This could have been useful.
These are raw materials for making magic. Anti-Greenleaf and any other rogue witches out there probably get their supplies here. Maybe just don't touch anything back here, please. Chains? Who's getting chained up here? You can't think I'm the only one the crooked man has under his yoke. Is this what those loans get you? That crooked piece of shit. Ribbons, chains, it's... it's all the fucking same. What are they making here? I'm just a butcher. You want to talk T-Bones? <laughs> that I can do. This stuff is out of my league. There are a lot of nasty spells you can make with the right equipment. What the hell is that? I know this isn't your coat. What's it doing here? It's a coat. What's the big deal about some dirty... Looks like Cranes. It's seen some abuse. I'm sure he handled it just fine. No time for traveler's checks, huh? He won't be needing this anymore. Sick piece of... The Shard. It's the Shard. Finally. Hey, hold on. Well, I'm real happy you found what you're looking for, Bigby. But what about me? Huh? What the hell am I supposed to do now? I'm gonna have to spend the rest of my short life looking over my shoulder for Bloody Mary. Report to the business office. Tell Snow I sent you there, and we'll, uh, we'll figure something out. Some kind of protection. Thank you. Thank you, Sheriff. Yeah, today, so peace out.